what's up y'all it's mika welcome back to the channel if you are new go ahead and hit the subscribe button and the notification bell if you're returning hey girl how you doing how's your week going how is your day going i hope you are having a wonderful tuesday if not i hope it gets better because tomorrow is hump day and tomorrow is 420 y'all so miss heaven is here if you know miss heaven then you know her uh, if you know you know but she's gonna be getting some extra extra long c curved nail tips and i'm just gonna go ahead and size these out for her for her nails and we're gonna go jump right into the set So what I like to do with the tips is cut that pointy end off of the side so then that way they can fit better to uh, the client's nail. And since these are C-curved, they do have like a high arch. So I really like need to cut most of it off so then that way it can just go ahead and fit to uh, her nail plate. Also to apply these um, tips, I'm going to go in with the McCart nail glue and that is how I'm just going to apply these tips onto my client's nail. Okay, y'all, so now that the nails are all shaped and I did apply base coat on top of her natural nail and on the tip after I, you know, buffed it and everything, now I'm just going to apply um, a base coat on the nail one more time and I'm going to stick the sequences into the uncured base coat. And again, I'm going in with all the, um, the bright colors and I'm going in with the solid hearts, not the cutout hearts, the solid hearts. So I did go ahead and apply all the sequences onto all of the nails. So this is sped up because this was a long behind clip. Because I took my time and, you know, uh, applying sequences one by one is just so time consuming, you guys. But um, anyways, yeah, I'm just doing, I'm just going to show you guys me doing two fingers, my pinky and my index finger because it's repetitive and I don't want to bore you guys, friend. So 
So in this clip, you'll see that I'm using a different utensil to pick up my sequences because when I was using the tweezers, the tweezers just wasn't working and I, I don't know. So I went in and I'm using my wax pen and that just like sped up the process for me. Um, it was really easy. So I suggest that if you're going to use your tweezers, stick them in some water so then that way you can pick up your products and place them onto the nail. If not, get your wax pen. So now I'm just going to float a base coat on top of all of the sequences because if you've seen on the pinky finger, I applied a layer of base coat on the nail and then put the sequences on with the base coat not being cured. But with the rest of the nails, I just put it on that tacky, tacky, that sticky inhibition layer for when you apply the base coat. I just stuck those on there. So these nails, I'm just floating like floating the um the gel polish on top and if you could tell like some of them didn't move but i'm totally fine with that but if you don't want them to move just put them into some uncured base coat and then cure it for um 30 to 60 seconds now the base coat is cured now i'm just gonna go in on top of the sequences with my milky white um gel polish to give it like a shadow effect y'all know i like the little shadow box look so i'm just gonna go in with one coat on camera and then off camera i did go in with two coats and i did the um back and forth method like i'm dragging it down this way and then i drag it back up the up towards the cuticle that way the um the polish is getting into all of the crevices if the sequences was not pushed down into the gel correctly Now I'm going to go in with my McCart's Clear Poly Gel and I'm going to do the two beat method that works best for me. I do the um, the full like nail area first, pat that out, make sure that's correct. And then I cure it for like 30 seconds and then I go back with my cuticle bead, make sure that's good, don't touch the cuticle and just, you know, make sure everything is all you know my cuticle area is all good and then i cure that for 60 seconds um i am using alcohol for my slip solution i don't use a base coat anymore i'm just you know you go through a lot of base coat when you're using it for you know nails and doing it for poly gel and stuff so i just use um regular alcohol or i may use like the slip solution that comes with it if it's like a poly gel kit or something like that but I'm just going to do that. This is repetitive, so we are going to go ahead and speed things along. Just 
The poly gel is now applied onto all of the nails and it is cured. So now I'm just going to go in with um, my filing process. I'm just going to go ahead and clean up the side walls of the nails. Make sure they're straight and crisp. And then I'm going to go in with my e-file with a sanding band. And I'm just going to go ahead and smooth the, the top of the nails. So now I like I would like to take the time to thank you guys for subscribing. Thank you guys for getting me to 100 subscribers. I know that you've seen that last week. Yes. Um, I'm still trying to get everything together for the giveaway, you guys. I don't know how I'm going to do it. I don't know how I'm going to go about it. But um, please just expect, you know, a giveaway coming up. Now that one, that will be like... Um, that will be like um that won't be will be public it wouldn't be like a hit and giveaway or anything like that that one will be public am i gonna do a giveaway for 100 subscribers i think i am i think i am yeah so yeah so stay tuned for that you guys but if you are new to the channel i do want to welcome you um with open arms welcome to my nail journey um if you are returning you know girl thank you and how you doing girl i hope you're doing good i hope you're having a good week i think i already said that if you are returning and have not subscribed yet, I don't know what you're doing. Just go ahead and hit the subscribe button. It's totally free. It's not going to cost you nothing, but it will definitely help me out. If you don't want to subscribe, go ahead and just hit the like um, button of the video. Or you can go on my page and just hit the like button of all the videos. That would, <laughs> that would really help me out and I would really appreciate it. But yeah, you guys, um, this set was just something that... I seen and I kind of like recreated it and it didn't really turn out how I wanted it to turn out you know we're always our hardest critics but we just gonna keep it pushing so can you guys tell that like my poly gel application has gotten a little bit better like it's not all lumpy and bumpy and it's just like perfect I'm not gonna say perfect no it's not perfect but it's perfect for me I'll say that it's it's perfect for me because I see the improvement of what I've been doing and how I'm doing now jaw and crap no i can't i don't have no kind of i can't do that <laughs> but y'all i went ahead and tried to retrieve some some drip i don't know what's been going on i'm just like really into this drip you know this drip drop drop down on me rain down on me drop 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 dribbly drop 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 a drop drop dribbly drop i don't know but I'm just into the little drips because I don't know. I need to I really need to figure out how to make these look better because it, these are not hitting how they're supposed to hit y'all. Like 
if y'all have any tips on how I can make some drops, dribbly drop, 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 a drain, rip, drop, drop, drops, or whatever on my nails, then let me know. Because I would, I would love to know how to do some dribbly drops, dribbly drops on my nails. But, hey, we on YouTube. I might as well just look up a YouTube video and try to do it. But it seems like I don't never practice until I, I turn on the camera. Like, real, like, no cap. That's when I really do nails is when I turn on the camera. Like, I don't do nails on, you know, any other day or anything like that. I do them as soon as I turn on the, ca as soon as I turn on the camera. I feel like, ow, we got to do a set. We got to record it. Even if it's, like, something that I'm first first trying i always feel like i just gotta turn on the camera like girl practice first before you turn on the camera and try to make a fool of yourself mika like what is you doing you ain't gonna be satisfied to these people um uh, talk about you for real for real how you and your feelings let me stop y'all i love y'all y'all not gonna talk about me i hope not like if y'all talk about me then i hope it's something funny like that girl don't know how to do no nails though but she funny her voice so supposed to be funny as hell say something like that <laughs> So as y'all seen, I went ahead and went in with the sprinkles while I was trying to do my little rap battle or whatever. I went ahead and went in with the sprinkles um, with some gel polish. And now I'm just going in with some McCart rhinestone glue and those McCart gems that came in the April's Your Nail Lab monthly box subscription. And I'm just going to do a little bling work here or whatever and then i'm just gonna go in with um some caviar beads to give it a little bit more detail and then after i do that for the pinky i have this 3d sucker um this big like sucker to go on the pinky um i didn't really want that to go on the pinky i thought i had a 3d ice cream cone uh, but i didn't because that's how i envisioned it in my head like 3d ice cream cone but all i have is this 3d lollipop and it was hard for this lollipop to get one i'm not sure if it's my lamp y'all like in the previous video my my color was wrinkling and then it's just like sometimes my poly gel isn't setting or this didn't set like this did not set like y'all gonna see it look like this turnt and then y'all gonna see it another time it's gonna be turned another way because it's just all messed up i, I think I, I need to get a drill a dust collector and a new lamp like that's those are three big things that's gonna cost that i need to get and y'all know i don't like to spend a lot of money i'm cheap like y'all know i put those things on four quick easy payments quick fast in a hurry because I don't, I don't have time for it but anyways y'all um now i'm just gonna go in and top coat all of the nails and that will be it for the set top coat the nails and then um cure them in the lamp for a total of 30 to 60 seconds my this lamp that i have it's it automatically goes to 90 seconds but um just gonna go ahead and top coat these nails y'all and this is it this is the set if you like the set go ahead like comment and subscribe um in the comments we're going to use a what haven't we used yet we're gonna use a a, a a rain droplet i think they have a rain droplet in the comments i mean in the emojis so let's use a rain droplet we can use that or we can use a sucker either one of those like a lollipop sucker i think they have like a lolly some kind of candy or something in there so rain droplet or the sucker or you know candy for the emoji for this video you guys um i really hope you guys enjoyed the video i hope you guys are enjoying the content on my channel i am going to try to switch things up a little bit i might i might this is a big big mic i might do a she in try on haul because I bought a whole bunch of stuff this is for this Texas trip, y'all. Like I told y'all, I was going to Texas. I'm going to Texas at the end of the month. So I bought a lot of stuff. And, you know, we need to get into it. We need to we need to talk about it. We got to talk about it. And, you know, the shipping wasn't bad at all. So we're going to talk about it. So if y'all want that video on my channel, my Shein try on haul for, I guess you can call it spring or Texas clothes. I don't know. I just bought some some stuff. Some stuff that I normally wouldn't wear. 
But if y'all want to see that, go ahead and comment down below, okay? This video is coming to an end. I love you guys. You know, I don't have to say it twice. Y'all know I don't got to say it twice. But I'm going to say it again. I love you guys. I don't have to say it twice. Like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.